can finally say it. The NBA regular season is about to get underway. And here at 2K Sports, we couldn't be happier. And on tap tonight, it's the Houston Rockets going up against the Detroit Pistons. This is Kevin Harlan courtside with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our reporter tonight on the sideline, David Aldridge. NBA fans, it's a brand new season. Day one is upon us, and we've got some great games for you. Kevin, one of my favorite days of the year. These fans have waited all summer to see their teams back in action, and you can feel the joy throughout the league. Now here is Hamilton. The shot, no good. Here's Francis. Outside Thomas. To the left wing. To the inside. Here's Yao. And finished off by Yao. White seeing me use that size. Absorb the contact and finish. Outside Phillips. Pass to Hamilton. Tries it from 19, and he hits the jumper for two. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. And here's Houston. And they're starting off the season against this Detroit team. And some nice passing there by Houston. Yao with a screen on Hamilton. Mobile. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And Mobley is really an outstanding scorer. Coutinho is a versatile player with a pure stroke as a left-handed shooter. First trip to the line for him here. Shooting two. The first one falls. Both free throws, good for Mobley. Free throw shooting is about mechanics, confidence, and your mental approach. He's locked in from there most every night. Outside, Billups passes it to Hamilton. Five on the clock. Here's Curry. It's deflected. against Mobley. The pass to Rice. Here's Francis. Yao with a screen on Billups. Francis passes to Yao and taken away by Wallace. Here's Hamilton. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway. So a three-point play chance for him. Great teamwork punctuated by a strong finish. That is the perfect fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. The Pistons shooting their first free throw of the night here. And, and their free throw percentage as a unit last year, 76%, right around the middle of the road. just constantly working his tail off. Excels shooting it from mid-range. Just always on the move, constantly working off screen. Here's Francis. Rice kicks to Mobley. Pass to Francis. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. 
outside Phillips. No one near Curry as he lets it go. And yes, a nice assist from Phillips. Boy, I like how Chauncey Billups looks to share the ball. He's a sturdy point guard with a great feel for when his guys are open. Here's Francis. Pass to Mobley. Three-pointer. And finished off by Yao. Nothing soft about the putback there. And, and why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. Well, you know, if nobody's going to put a body on him, then that's going to be the result. Now here's Billups. Wallace with a screen for Billups. No oh, good on the three. Rockets are gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Here's Rice, and the shot goes down. And you simply can't give Rice those close looks because he is going to make you pay. The Pistons trailing. And here is Billups. Hasn't made one yet. Robinson down low. Thomas is there. Yao with the block. Now here's Mobley. Outside Thomas. Here's Rice. Yao with a screen on Kirk. It's taken away by Wallace. Curry on the wing. Back to Billups. Passes it to Hamilton. The shot from 20 feet away. The basket good off the assist from Billups. Billups has got three assists now in this one. For Houston, they've gone four or five from the field so far. Here's Francis. Now the pass to Yao. Over Wallace. And Houston again with the bucket. And we saw this in China. Now we're seeing it here. When Ming gets the ball around the basket, he is almost a lock to score. Now here is Hamilton. He's got seven. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That's on Yao Ming. And Hamilton has no off switch. His unlimited energy plays a big hand in him drawing fouls. All right, well, look at how the points have been generated so far. Scoring breakdown for Houston. Everything working for them inside so far, guys. Tons of high-quality shots that they're knocking down inside. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball, working to rotate around the defense and find those quality looks. That's good from Hamilton. and hits both of them. The Rockets have gone 5 of 6 so far from the field to start out the game. Pass to Rice. Here's the 3. And the 3 ball is good. Rice has got 5 points so far. And we've seen several lead changes tonight. Neither team giving an inch. Yeah, and the lead has changed hands and it just hasn't stayed in those hands very long when it's changed. Back and forth we go. Outside Billups. That shot is off. Great D that time from Thomas. Houston leading by three. Francis passes to Mobley. And Thomas has it in the corner. Pass to Yao. Six on the shot clock. Can't connect from 13 feet out. Detroit's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. And he's going up for the alley oop. My goodness. Say, say that one. I, I want to see that again. Me too. Just absolutely beautiful. Virtually impossible to top that alley oop. Here's Francis, who's guarded by Billups. And it's sent back by Wallace. And this is why Wallace is an elite level defender, has a great sense of timing for when to rise up and contest shots. 
Guys back and forth this first half. And this could continue to go back and forth the entire way. And now the first timeout called here for the Rockets. Rockets have gone six of nine, shooting it well. Yao with a screen on Billups. Francis passes to Yao and finished off by Yao. And just what we want to see from Yao, setting solid screens and helping out. The kick out to Billups. Hamilton sets a screen for Robinson. Another three for Detroit. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Mobley outside. Outside Thomas. Let's it fly from 18. Rebounded by the Pistons. Here's Hamilton. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. And not just a mid-range threat. Hamilton also adept at finding ways to score. All right, we'll take a look now at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Pistons. They have started this game looking to push the tempo, and it's working for them. Great job of scoring in transition. You know, points off turnovers is something else they've excelled in. I expect the opponent at least to try to squeeze that orange a little better. Here's Rice. Five points in the game. Mobley dishes to Yao. That's him. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. Outside Billups. Passes to Hamilton. Shoots it. Back to Billups. There's the pass to Hamilton. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Here's Rice. Pass to Yao. Houston moving it around. Mobley against Curry. Yao lays it up and banks it in. And now just a one-point Piston lead. In his rookie year, we're seeing why the scouts were so high on Yao. This guy has limitless offensive potential. Now here is Hamilton. He's got 11. Shoots over Mobley. And again, it's the Pistons missing. Boy, he's got to be kicking himself for failing to make that shot. That's money. Here's Norris. Kicks to Rice. Five to shoot. Here's the teardrop. Rebound by Wallace. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on him. And that one drops for him. Curry's got five now. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Mobley outside. Thomas passes to Yao over Wallace. And Yao gets it to go on the assist by Thomas. He's got 14. It's good to see Yao handle the contact. That was a question mark for him coming into the draft. And the Pistons decide to take their first timeout right here. Teams will make substitutions. The Pistons leading. Pass to Gibson. Here's Barry. Williamson right side. Yao with the block. 
and one of the most highly anticipated prospects to enter this league. He has already shown an innate ability to alter in block shots. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. 156 left to play here in the first. Here's Hamilton. Sinks the triple. And the Pistons lead by four. Not too much respect shown to him by the defenders. Here's Norris. Still yet to score. Nasty out. Over Gibson. The shot's good from Yao. And how about Mean just going to work? His guys are getting him the ball, and boy, is he rewarding. We've got 118 left here in the opening quarter. Here's Barry. Williamson, the screen. Takes a shot at the elbow. Rebound by Yao. Yao's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Hawkins passes to Thomas. Thomas, a screen. And it's all evened up. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. There's 42 seconds left in the first quarter. Hamilton outside. Three-pointer. It's rebounded by Houston. Yao's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Hawkins passes to Norris. Hawkins with it. The feed now to Yao. Yao draws the double. Here's Norris. Still without a basket. They get a bet. And Yao gets it to go. A great follow. When Yao gets good position, he's impossible to move. And he's got great hands. Thomas grabs the rebound. Oh, he gets it to go. Wow. It counts. Wow. What a shot. And listen to this place explode. And they're scoring pretty well as we conclude the first quarter. Rockets ahead as they end the first quarter. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. Let's quickly break down the game we've seen so far from the Rockets, guys. Well, when you control the glass, you control the second chance opportunities on both ends. And, you know, their rebounding advantage has been glaring, simply outworking them on the boards for that entire first quarter. Count it. Taylor's got the lead up to seven now for the Rockets. Nice play, and you can see they're gathering momentum. You know, they need to stay aggressive here. Build the lead up while they've got the chance. Don't waste this opportunity. Now here's Billups. Mobley sets the pick for Billups. The 11-footer. The second chance effort. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. I mean, that's the message they were sending with that foul. Nothing easy inside. free throw no good you know Greg one of the more exciting draft prospects this year has to be this player from Syracuse Carmelo Anthony well when you win a college championship that gets attention and you do it as a freshman who was leading the team in scoring and rebounding he is a no-brainer Kenshin's is checked in for you and the second free throw good here's Francis With the drive, and he jams it with authority. Oh, great take by Stevie Franchise. Explosive on the bounce. Pistons trail by eight. 
Miller play just over a minute of basketball here in the second quarter. The pass to Billings. On baseline, Jay. That's good on the jump shot. Billups has got five now. And that's pure from Billups. So assertive, firing away from the mid-range. Inside. Here's Catchings. And he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. Yeah, I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Hey, they've got a nice, comfortable lead here, fellas. Might as well keep it simple. Do it a plain, simple one-hander, just like pound cake. Billups spreading that ball around like butter. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And, and over the course of last year, he was up over 90%. And with a stroke like that, you see why. And, guys, the numbers don't lie. I mean, he was such a reliable presence at the free throw line all throughout last season. And the Rockets making a change here. Kelly's checked in. And the Pistons making a change here as well. Reed Eves checked in for Mobley. That's it. Here's Francis. There's the screen. That's good, and he's now three for four from the field. And Francis, fearless as a player. Somebody that feels like he can score inside anytime he wants to. Pass to Billings. Unloads. It's rebounded by Houston. Uh, you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look, but when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Here's Francis. Six points for him. Pass to Norris. Lock at six. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. And the next one puts him in the bonus. Yep, they'll be trying to draw that next foul quickly so they can start getting those easy chances at the strike. For the Rockets, Weiss has checked in, and it's Mobley in for Hawkins. Then for the Pistons, Gibson's checked in. Davis is subbed in for Barry. Outside, Davis. Williamson a screen on Mobley. And here's Davis for three. Taylor with the rebound. Houston leading by six. Mobley outside. Here's Francis. He kicks to Rice. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. And he makes it look so easy. Rice's fluid shooting form really helps him on those long-range misses. Outside, Billups. Passes it to Williamson. Shot clock at six. Outside, Billups. Detroit, no good that time either. There's some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's equally good at guarding against him. Oh, that was a nice find by Francis. He spots a wide open man timeout, and timeout. hits him in rhythm. Now a timeout called by Detroit. Detroit. Curry comes in for Davis. The pass to Billings. the middle. Here's Wallace, and Wallace slams it in. 
Wallace going up hard and strong for the throwdown. Major athleticism. Here's Francis. He's got six. He dishes it to Taylor. That shot is off target. That makes him two for three. Phillips with the ball. Has to Atkins from outside the arc. And yes, a nice assist from Phillips. Phillips has got his seventh assist here tonight. Pockets leading by six. Here's Francis. Has to Rice from the arc. Rebound by Wallace. Wallace has got rebound number five here tonight. This is a duet. Wallace a screen. Atkins passes to Wallace. It's Williamson, top of the key. Just three to shoot. Here's Phillips. And Detroit again with the bucket. Just straight tricking the defender with the shot fake. This is how it's done. Here's Francis. And there's the pass to Rice. There's the pick. Over to the left wing. Here's Mobley. Buries the long-range jumper. Mobley's got five points so far. And the accuracy Mobley has from three-point range is crazy. He's had stretches during his career, but it seems like he just can't miss. Now here's Williamson. Still scoreless. And Phillips gets it to go. And just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. Pass to Norris. Taylor up top. Wallace covering. Taylor inside. Wallace on him. Shot by Taylor. No good. And here's Curry who brings it up for the Pistons. Next up for them, the Knicks coming out here to play. That'll be the first of two straight at home. Williamson in the post. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. No clue <laughs> where that pass is going. That is a brutal turnover. Houston leading by five. Timeout time called time for Rockets. Guard. Norris. Pass to Rice. Here's Norris. He's guarded by Billups. Now Yao. Takes a three. Mobley misses. Pistons trail by five. It's Rip Hamilton on the way. Covered by Mobley. Hamilton kicks to Curry. Hamilton the pass to Robinson. Six to shoot. The Pistons need to get off a shot here. Phillips from outside, and that's good. Robinson picking up the assist. Phillips has got 12 in the game. The Rockets have gotten seven of their 12 field goal attempts to drop here in the second quarter, up over 50%. Driving the lane, and Yao gets it to go. And his stroke has been dead on from the outside. I mean, inside, outside, it just doesn't matter. Outside, Phillips. Passes to Hamilton. Shoots over Mobley. No good from Hamilton. That's exactly how you have to defend him. He's a guy that the D needs to be aware of at all times. Mobley outside. 
On the pass to Yao, and Rip Hamilton gets the whistle that time. That'll be his second foul of the game. And the Pistons making a change here. Atkins checked in. Now into the lineup for the Pistons. Number seven, Chuck Atkins. It's Thomas on the wing. Rice passes to Norris. The three-pointer no good. Pistons trail by four. To the paint. Here's Wallace. And it's Wallace with the jam. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there. Sure. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. Here's Rice. He's got eight. Now that's good. yao has got four this quarter. Oh, playmaking isn't a focus for Rice, but this opening just too good to not make it. Curry on the wing. Let's it go from deep. Mobley with the rebound. Houston leading by four. Here's Norris. Out to the right wing. Wallace against Yao. Shot clock at five. And yes, it's good. Yao's got 24. This is why they get Yao the ball inside. He's basically unguardable this close to the rim. Pass to Hamilton. Releases. Good for basket number six from him in the contest. He's shooting six for 12. And that assist got him a little nod from his teammate after that. Houston's gotten fewer than half of their three-pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. Norris, the pass to Yao. Picked by Yao. Down low. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. He's got 26. You know, when Yao cuts like this, you got to try to get in front of him and impede his progress. Beautiful execution in the pick and roll there. Now, here is Robinson. Wallace inside. Covered by Mobley. And it's in there. Wallace has got eight. And as one of the strongest guys in the league, that's where Wallace wants to operate, down in the paint. Thomas passes to Rice to the inside. It's deflected. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the ball. Yeah, gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. Clearly a careless pass. He got away with one there. Williamson is checked in for Detroit. One sixteen left in the second quarter. Francis. Rebound, Detroit. And you can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. Now here is Hamilton. 16 points for him. Now Curry. Down to five on the shot clock. That's good. The Houston leaders cut down to just two points on the bucket from Richard Hamilton. Boy, he can let it loose. The quick release shown by Hamilton that time. Mobley outside, and Thomas has it in the corner. Now against Wallace. Now here's Yao. Not a lot of room. Releases. Mobley misses. Detroit's gotten half their shots from three-point range to go down in the second quarter. Three of six from downtown. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Curry passes to Hamilton to the paint. Here's Wallace, and Wallace slams it in. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. You know what, guys? Honestly, I didn't think he'd win that battle. I mean, that's a lot of height to give up. Here's Mobley. And he beats the buzzer. Yeah, that's just an amazing way to get that ball off in time. I agree. I mean, and to have the composure to lock in and get off a shot he feels confident about, 
That's good work. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Rockets lead by three. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. Yao Ming really has his fingerprints all over this one. Well, with a double-double in hand through two quarters, you can just imagine what his stat line will look like at the end of this one. Yeah, he's got that locked-in look in his eyes tonight, and he's not going to start taking it easy. I think he's going to be going hard until that final whistle blows. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. Here's Francis. Driving to the basket. Thomas passes to Francis. A kick out to Mobley. Here's Francis. Dishes it to Young. Mobley outside. Over Hamilton. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Mobley's got 10 points in the game. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Hamilton left side. From past the arc. It's rebounded by Houston. yao has got rebound number 13 with that last one. Tipped away. Pass to Rice. Back to Thomas. Mobley right side. Yao with a screen on Hamilton. A putback. It's good on the putback. Now it's a seven-point rocket lead. Oh, how about the hustle from Yao? And there's nothing the defense can do to stop it. Here's Robinson on the wing, Wallace. The Pistons working the ball around now. Phillips passes to Kirby. Beyond the arc. And there's Phillips. That's good. The assist by Curry. Three points. Curry's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Two minutes into the second half of play now. Passes it to Mobley. Now with the ball. Wallace covering. Wallace against Yao. Back to Mobley. There's the dish to Thomas. Puts up a three. Rebound by Wallace. Wallace has got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Inside. And Wallace slams it in. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Somebody you can count on. He is an extremely reliable finisher. And the Rockets with possession here after the basket by Detroit. Yes, that goes in. Yao's yeah, got four points now in the quarter. Yeah, he, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. You know, numbers don't always tell the story, guys, but his assist totals do paint the picture here. I mean, he's got everybody involved. At the tip, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Wallace has got 14 points. Wallace is just a fighter. He puts his hard hat on and goes after it on the board. The pass to Rice. A three-pointer is right on target. Could have been much better defense. I mean, you can't give this guy any room to operate. Outside, Phillips. Little under two and a half minutes off the clock now, here in the third. Robinson on the wing. Wallace with a screen for Phillips. Trying to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Rockets leading by five. Mobley, left side. Pass to Francis. Yao with a screen on Billups. To the middle. 
Second shot opportunity. Good on the bucket. Now he's got 32 points in the game. There are big men. And then there's Yao Ming. Wow. 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 Now here is Hamilton. 18 points for him. Hits it from three-point range. He's got 18. And we always talk about making your teammate better. That assist was right on target. Here's Francis. Fires from the wing. They get it back. And the shot is good. Yao's got 34 points. Yeah, it's not easy trying to keep Yao Ming off the glass. Just wreaking havoc with his activity on the offensive board. Now here's Billups. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. Houston leading by six. Mobley outside. And Thomas has it in the corner. Hey, hey, watch him, watch him, watch him. Esti Yao. Over once. Yao, no luck. Take what's available. Use the fadeaway when the defender's there on you. In the corner, it's Hamilton. Shoots over Mobley. And Hamilton gets it to go on the assist by Curry. Curry's got six assists now in the game. Here's Francis. He's guarded by Billups. Here's Rice. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. Love the no hesitation shot release of Glenn Rice. You see the confidence he has, and for good reason. Hamilton against Mobley. Hamilton outside. Into the lane. Almost, but it rolls out. Houston's gone two or three when they ventured outside the arc in the third quarter. Rice passes to Francis. Yao with a screen on Billups. Inside. And Yao slams it in. The height is miraculous. Being just scaring the rim. Now a timeout called by Detroit. Williamson is checked in for Robinson. Number 34, Boris Williamson. Pistons trail by nine. Outside, Billups. Francis grabs the board. Houston's gone downtown 13 times in this game, and they're just over 50%. 7 of 13 on threes. To the inside. Here's Yale. The timely screen gave him a step, but he took it all the way. And when you foul Ming, you really got to foul it or else he'll power through and finish. And a chance for just a second now to check out the scoring breakdown for the Rockets. And they're playing beautiful basketball right now, racking up the assists by playing so unselfishly, just finding the open man. And, you know, they've done a fantastic job scoring inside as a result, finding plenty of opportunities to cash in near the hoop. That one falls for Yao. At a towering 7-6 with skill, Yao Ming is one of the better center prospects we've seen in quite some time. Someone you can build a franchise around. Now here's Williamson. He has yet to score. Outside Curry. Rocket six. Williamson with a screen for Curry. Shot to stop the run. And that one, good. 
Well, the, the pick didn't exactly neutralize the defender, but, but good concentration on the finish to still get the basket. Down low, yeah. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Hey, you try to contest mean shot, but at seven foot six, it's almost impossible. And these are his second and third free throws tonight. And the first one at the line is good. And, and, you know, he's such a huge figure from a cultural standpoint. Yao is also someone teammates love playing with because of that easygoing personality. And he can't hit the second. Pistons trail by 11. Outside Billups. Up top Curry. Lots of room. And yes, a nice assist from Billups. Billups has got assist number eight here in this one already. Here's Francis. He's got six. No good from outside. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. Pass to Hamilton. Mobley comes with the double team. The Pistons working the ball around now. Curry can't get it to go. You know, the defense to me looked like they were okay to let him prove he could make that shot. There's the pass to Francis. Over Billups. And that one's good, Francis. Francis has got eight points. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on. Now a timeout called by Detroit. Substitutions here. Williams and dishes to Kirk. Pass to Williamson. Yao with the block. Oh, this is the impact Ming makes defensively using that huge reach to block or alter shots. It's good. Norris has got the lead up to 13 now for the Rockets. And really just unselfish basketball on the interior. That's the kind of pass a coach loves to see. To the paint, here's Hamilton, and he uses the glass on the lane. Hamilton's got 22. And once he sees the ball go through, Rip can pile up the points. A truly elite score. Mobley outside. There's the three. Krill's the three-pointer. I like the offensive awareness to exploit that lack of coverage on that play. Pistons trail by 14. Pass to Hamilton. Curry on the wing. Drops one in from the wing. Curry's got six here in this quarter. Sensational ball movement there. When you pass the ball like that, good things happen. Norris, the pass to Taylor. Taylor. Detroit with the rebound. Curry on the wing. 11 points in the game. Count the basket. Five points in the game. Taking it up strong against size. He does not lack for confidence. That's well done there. I mean, don't even give him a chance to get to the block. Get in tight and finish at the rim. 
gets it to go from beyond the arc. And the Rockets lead by 13. And guarding him on the perimeter isn't a priority for them right now, but if this continues, it will be. Passes it to Hamilton. Again, the Pistons score. I tell you what, what a good thing that he showed up today because without him, this thing would already be over. Mobley outside. And another three for Houston. Hit works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. 54 seconds left here in the third quarter. Here's Hamilton. Yao with the block. Here's Norris. He's got eight. Mobley outside. The pass to Yao. Taylor against Williamson. Six on the shot clock. Williamson with the block. Hamilton outside to the wing right side. We've got 13 seconds left in the third quarter. Pass to Curry. There's the triple. Good on the three-point shot. Curry's got nine points now in the quarter. So it's Houston holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for them. We'll get right back to the action when we return. the fourth quarter upon us. Time is running out for this game to become competitive. Pistons trail by 11. Here's Barry. Pass to Billups. For the three. Here's Gibson. And a miss there with a chance to cut the lead to single digits. And for Houston, they're shooting 61%, showing all the indications of an offense that is locked in. Here's Francis. Finds the bottom of the bucket from 13 feet out. Francis has got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for the Rockets. Here's Barry. Outside, Billups. Fires for three. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Tremendous hustle working hard for that bucket. Rockets leading by 11. We play just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Here's Francis. Just five to shoot. Norris. Nice shot from the wing. And the Rockets lead by 13. For Detroit, they've gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. Outside, Billups. Passes it to Hamilton. Jacks up a three. And yes, a nice assist from Billups. Billups has got assist number nine now. Wow, what an effort here tonight. The pass to Norris. Here's Beck. Williamson against Taylor. Shot clock at six. No good with the wing jumper. That's one he knows he should have drained. Outside, Billups. Lost to Hamilton. Over Hawkins. No good from Hamilton. 
Rockets leading by 10. Pass to Beck. Here's Francis, covered by Williamson. And he dunks it down. Boy, really love the athleticism Francis has. Gets off the floor quickly to jam it home. Outside, Billups. Passes to Hamilton over Francis. And it's Hamilton that time on the assist by Billups. Billups has got assist number 10 tonight with that last one. It's been like this all night for both teams. The offenses having their way. Any lull in the action so far has been short-lived because there have been nothing but buckets in this one. To the inside. Another possession, another assist. That makes 15 assists. He's been one step ahead of the defense all game long. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Very comfortable from out there. Hamilton oozing with confidence on that triple. Timeout called the Rockets. Thomas checked in for the Rockets. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. I was able to listen in on what Rudy Tomjanovich went over with his team. Now they've been happy with the way the team is shooting. He reminded players to keep taking those threes, that they've had some clean looks. But that three goes in, it's always a welcome sight. Guys? Thanks, David. Here's Norris. Here's Francis. Offensive rebound. Up again. Another miss. Boy, they had their chance there, but couldn't get it to go. And the shot goes in. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. Hey, guys standing around spectating. I mean, you got to get in there and get tough. Phillips passes to Curry. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. How about battling through the impact there and then willing that basketball in? Boy, it does your heart good to see that kind of determination in a player. Really excellent focus that time. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. Gets leading by eight. Here's Francis. Yao with a screen on Billups. And they'll get another chance. Detroit's gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. And Williamson gets it to go. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Here's Francis. Kicks it to Rice. The three makes that one his sixth of the night. Shooting a very healthy six for nine. The jump shot of Rice gets it off so easily and so smoothly. Silk personified that jumper of his. And there's the pass to Billups. It's rebounded by Houston. Yao's got his 20th rebound here tonight. Saw that coming. Here's Francis. Off target from three-point range. And so Curry will bring it up for the Pistons. Outside, Billups. Over to the wing. Here's Perry. Wow, came this close to a four-point play. Led to the line for three free throws. And that could have gone from bad to worse if that three had dropped. And it came pretty close to falling. Boy, he sure did. I mean, that would have been a heck of a shot. Let's see if he can get all three at the line now. Three shots. Three shots. And he hits the first of three. He 
hits the second from the line. He makes all three. Houston leading by six. Inside. And it's sent back by Wallace. And here we go. The fader. It's rebounded by Houston. And that'll be the first of a two-game road trip for him. Down low. Right block shot, and that one's good, Francis. On or off the ball, Francis is a threat. Someone who can flat out light it up. And here is Billups. Look from Hamilton. The basket good off the assist from Billups. Hamilton's got 34 points. Textbook, nice pass, great catch, even better finish. Here's Francis. To the middle, here's Yao, and another assist. The chemistry he has with his guys is impressive. Keeping his head on a swivel, actively seeking out his teammate. Outside Billups, here's Hamilton. Again, the Pistons, good for two. And dependable at running the offense, Billups just understands his teammates depend on him to get them involved. Here's Francis with the putback. And Thomas with the second chance points. Thomas got four points this quarter. You know, his positioning near the hoop always to his advantage. Just a terrific job to tip that one back in. Pass to Hamilton. Here's Barrett. Here's Wallace. And the jam by Wallace. And no doubt, they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Well, I like the way he capped off that drive. The one-hand hole punch. Here's Francis after the basket by Detroit. Six to shoot from 10 feet out. And it's Houston with another. Pistons trail by eight. Outside, Billups. Pass to Barry. Let's the three fly. And another three for Detroit. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensive. Here's Francis. Outside, Thomas. Lock at six. Shot on the wing. Here's Yao. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. Yao's got 44. Really strong rebounding on the interior. And he gets the easy putback. Here's Barron. Passes it to Billups. Puts up a three. Doesn't go for him. And since halftime, he has just been ice cold. Just can't seem to get anything to go his way. Rice passes to Francis. Here's Rice. Mobley outside. Now the pass to Francis. From downtown, hangs on the trifecta. And it's a 10-point rocket lead. Rarely lets it fly from three. Francis connects there to give himself some confidence. Time called here. The Pistons decide to talk it over. Change here. Robinson's checked in. Now into the lineup for the Pistons. Number 30, Clifford Robinson. Pass to Hamilton. 
back to Billups. And Robinson wide open. He shoots. And yes, a nice assist from Billups. Six points for Robinson. He had such a sweet three-point stroke there. And it can really open things up inside because as good as he shoots it, it forces the opposing bigs to have to step out on the perimeter. Here's Francis. Mobley outside. Just five on the clock. Thomas is screen on Hamilton. Mobley. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. It'll go. The Rocket lead is cut down to just eight points on the bucket from Hamilton. Clearly, he's one of the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. Here's Francis. Feeds it to Yao. And he comes up with the deuce. Yao's got six here in this quarter. The heads-up aggressive play right there. Saw the smaller man on him and took it straight to the basket. Now here's Billups. Defense right on him. Where he finds Robinson. Rockets with the rebound. Thomas got his eighth rebound here tonight. Obley up top. Covered by Hamilton. Outside Thomas. The 10 foot. Yao misses. And it's Curry with the ball. Bringing it up for the Pistons. Hamilton outside. Down low. Wallace. And it's Wallace slamming it down. I'll tell you what, his vertical is awesome off the charts. A short center who still makes his presence felt. And out of bounds. The Pistons will take it. Pistons ball. Fifty-five seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Hamilton. Off target with his three. They're in good position here to ride it out. Uh, certainly, if they just play smart, this game's over. Here's Francis. Who's guarded by Billups. The Rockets with another miss. Not enough ticks left on the clock to save them tonight. Not by a long shot. It's all but official. Coming good. And this is how you know Billups is a leader. He's ready to take that shot when you need it. And an intentional foul right there. And they go to the intentional foul. First personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Rockets, Steve Francis. First one drops, and that makes it a seven-point lead. Yeah, and Francis, you know, he's an athletic point guard, plays with tremendous confidence, and really knows how to motivate his teammates. And so both free throws are good, and it's an eight-point game. Timeout called the Pistons. They trail by eight. 23 seconds left in the game. Guys, your thoughts? Trying to keep hope alive, but, but I don't see them making a comeback. You know what? I'm sure crazier things have happened, or, or maybe not. It's, it's a long shot, though. Here's Hamilton. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Third personal foul. I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. Taking two shots. 
shooting two. Good on the first, and that narrows the gap to seven. Hamilton hits both of them. And that's an intentional foul. No choice but to foul there, but, it, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. But there was no time really to be selective. Stopping the clock was the priority. Mobley. He doesn't hit the first, and that was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. And he does get the second one, and that makes it a seven-point lead. Now a timeout called by Detroit. They're trailing by seven. 19 seconds left to play here in the fourth. seconds left to play in the final quarter and it's still a rare sight to see rebound numbers like the ones he's had tonight boy he has put in some major work he's earning his pay for sure here's Francis so we see the Rockets get the win here it was up for grabs right until the final seconds. Yeah, and, and for me, Kevin, what stood out is just the overall trust this group has in one another when it matters most. Doing what had to be done and to send these fans home happy. And that'll do it for the first game of the NBA season. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you later.